What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the program. Let's switch it up a little bit. Let's inject some humor into our day with Max Amini, Persian American comedian, very funny man. And let's see what he's got here. This uh, bit is titled My Friend Dick. I'm guessing uh, is one of his friends who, who was named Dick. Um, of course, Dick was like a shortened... Um, version of Richard if somebody's named Richard sometimes they'd call them Dick and there's an interesting history I think that comes from England where you know Rick because they'd call Richard Rick and then eventually it was like hey Rick hey Rick Rick uh Rick 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 and then eventually it was just turned into Dick 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 somehow it evolved from Rick 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 to Dick 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 so I don't know how that happened but evolution of, of names and words I suppose uh you know, speaking of unfortunate names, like, I always remember Bart Simpson, too, like, gag names. So, he would have, like, Seymour Butts, uh, Mike Roch, Mike Roch, Mike Roch, um, Amanda, Amanda Hug and Kiss, and, like, all of these different names like that. Like, just unfortunate names. So, um, yeah, let's see what he's going to say about uh, his friend Dick. Uh, You're happy you came to my show. What's your last name? <laughs> <laughs> the guy's last name's Dickinson. Uh, okay, okay. You're happy you came to my show. What's your last name? <laughs> <laughs> Dickinson. Even his own buddy's laughing at him. Let me tell you a story <laughs> real quick, Dickinson. I did have a friend at age seven. Yeah, age seven. I brought one of my friends home. When you're a young Persian kid, you live in America. You bring your friends home. It's very scary because your white friends need to be already educated before they meet your parents, <laughs> yeah? I'm seven, eight years old. I was seven. very young. I'm bringing my friend home. And I seven. Say, hey, bro, when you come in, when you see my parents, just if they said anything, just pretend it's cool, okay? Don't be scared. It really... It's highly advanced social etiquette for a seven-year-old to tell us, to warn his friend about his, his parents' uh, eccentricities. And it's cool, okay? Don't be scared. They're really nice people, but sometimes they come off scary, but they're really nice people, okay? It's like, all right, well, it's okay. So the kid walks into my house, my dad, who is this? <laughs> who are you? Who is your family? His what voice. does your father do? <laughs> Where you come from? It's so intense. <laughs> and I goes, my name is Dick. Dick! <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> your parents call you Dick. <laughs> Dick, honey, they call him Dick. <laughs> How does your mother call you? Dick, come in, Dick, go out. <laughs> and then he got mad. Get this Dick out of my house. <laughs> Get this Dick out of my house. <laughs> and I was a kid, I'm like, Dad, relax, I like Dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. That's the last day I saw Dick Dickinson. <laughs> That was the last time I saw Dick. <laughs> and you just brought that memory back into my head, Dickinson. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like it's, it, I mean, if you have an immature sense of humor, which is great, you know, people should be able to laugh at silliness. You know, we should all be able to be silly when it comes to comedy and, and not uh, be a prude, not be, um, you know, a Debbie Downer. Apologies to any Debbies that are watching. Where did Debbie Downer come from? Poor Debbie. And now, like, Karen's. Now, Karen's are thrown under the rug. If you're named Karen, you're, like, an, immediately people are conjuring up images of, you know, Karen asking for the manager, etc., etc. But Dick, yeah, that's a tough one. Um, here's a skit for you. Uh, the, the kid is mad. Uh, he's got nobody to go with him. Nobody to go golfing. And he, he's talking to his mother. But mom, there's no one to go golfing with. No one to go golfing with? What do you mean? I just... Nobody can go today. You can take Dick. Okay. Bye, everybody. Any recommendations, requests, put them down below. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace.